Ketamine has several street names such as Special K, Super K, and it was actually used as a general anaesthetic, as a sedative for minor surgery, and as a tranquilizer for animals. But in a street form, ketamine comes in a white powder form, can be mistaken for cocaine, though cocaine is more of a stimulant that acts on the dopamine receptors, while ketamine has more of a hallucinogenic effect, which means that you're likely to get hallucinations with ketamine. Now, ketamine also gives you this dissociative effect, which means you are detached from your sense of reality, surroundings, and you also detach from any emotions that you might feel, such as pain or having to mourn the loss of a loved one. Ketamine can make you feel calm, relaxed, make you not feel depressed, make you feel numb to emotions. And for that momentary time, you might actually not have any memories of any bad events that have happened, whether losing a loved one, car crash, or any negative experiences that you might have had. Now, in terms of the hallucinatory effect, that can usually last for 30 to 60 minutes while ketamine itself is quick acting and usually has an effect within a few minutes. The issue with ketamine is that in high doses you might get palpitations like a fast heart rate, headaches, nausea and vomiting and when you overdose on this medication you can actually have a slow breathing rate and can even cause death. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please feel free to like, share and subscribe.